your voice, your vote, and we begin tonight with California Governor Gavin Newsom, who is in West Michigan on this 4th of July campaigning for President Joe Biden. 13 on your side's Julia Gorman is here now with what he had to say in Van Buren County at the Democratic Party's 4th of July event in South Haven this afternoon. Julia? Julia, Governor Gavin Newsom was one of 20 Democratic governors to meet with the president just last night behind closed doors. Obviously, a top concern right now for many Americans on both sides of the aisle is can our current president be successful in a second term due to his age and other factors after his performance last week against former President Donald Trump? Well, Governor Newsom says yes, and he's not worried. Here's a look at the governor speaking to the crowd at the event in South Haven. He made sure to cite many of the successes of the Biden administration over the last three and a half years speaking to that crowd there. He talked about low unemployment rates for women and people of color. He talks about the current president's infrastructure work so far. He also talked about how Biden is working for everyone, Republicans included, citing putting money into many Republican districts over the last few years. Compared to a country led by former President Donald Trump, Governor Newsom compared the two as right and wrong, daylight and darkness. Joe Biden, regardless of time of life, has a quality of imagination where he's delivered more than any president in my lifetime in just three and a half years. I care about I'm old fashioned. Uh, I care about, you know, results um, and uh, and outputs. And uh, he's produced. And so, you know, I'll leave more objective minds to judge that. Uh, but I'm not looking for a performer in chief. I'm looking for a commander in chief. Now, Michigan's Republicans are responding to Governor Newsom's visit, saying, quote, Gavin Newsom campaigning in Michigan shows just how out of touch Joe Biden and his team are to Michiganders and the struggles we face here. I hope they enjoy their barbecue, which, thanks to Bidenomics, is significantly more expensive, end quote. And again, that is according to Michigan Republican Party Chair Pete Hoekstra. Now, for more information on our continuing coverage of the California governor's visit to our state, I send it back to Juliet. Julia, thank you. Well, our political reporter, Josh Albertus, just spoke to Governor Newsom in a one-on-one -on -one interview about his visit to West Michigan today. Coming up tonight at 11 o'clock, why Newsom says Michigan is key to winning the presidential race.